Welcome back, y'all. Twine Eagles 215. Now, we're going to jump right into this thing about who and what cornerback should we put out there. Now, as y'all know, we have Jalen Mills. We have Rashul Douglas. We have Craven LeBlanc. We have Avante Maddox. And we have Sidney Jones. I think I said all the guys. Now, um, you know, it's it's a it's a a big struggle uh with this. But I want to know what y'all guys think in the comment section to get this started. Who do y'all think? What cornerback should we start this year? Who do you think? And you can even tell why. Leave it down in the comment section. But, you know, for me, and Ronald Darby, too. I, I, did, I forgot. But Ronald Darby. So, um, we have a lot of cornerbacks. They're not getting paid a whole bunch of money. They're, they're young guys. They're developing. But they will actually be great when the time comes. Now, like I said, you have uh, Ronald Darby. He was coming off of ACL. I'm saying if these guys are healthy, who are you going to start? So you got Ronald Darby coming off the ACL. You have to start Ronald Darby. You know that. Um, for me, I feel like you have to put Avante Maddox in there. Now, the toss-up would be for uh, Jalen Mills, maybe, and Craven. I like Craven LeBlanc. I've been watching his highlights, doing a little research on the guy. The guy is amazing. The way he plays off the ball, his tackling, he he hits, um, you know, um, you know, and it's that's just what I think, you know what I mean? I'm jumping right into it. You get Darby, you get Avante, and I say you go with Craven LeBlanc. If you don't go with Craven LeBlanc, um, uh, it's it's kind of hard to say who else you can pick. Um, Jalen Mills is very good, but he is a, um, guy that gets beat a lot when it comes to double moves. He's a great red zone threat. He's an awesome red zone, uh, cornerback, but, uh, you know, as far as that goes, I think that is his strong points. Um, you know, Sidney Jones still has to prove himself. I mean, I don't know if I would put him out there and where. You know, I think he's better in the slot. So, I, I, I mean, you know, where did you put him? And do you take that risk of having him out there and, you know, putting him up against these, some of these elite uh, uh, receivers? You know what I mean? Um, Rasul Douglas is always good. You know, I just think that, you know, some of his talents go unappreciated sometimes and, I feel like if we start with uh, Rasul, it will be good. But then again, you know, we might need to see, let these guys battle it out to see what they can do. Um, like I said, I really like um, Craven LeBlanc. I think he can do, I think he can flourish. He got that interception in the Saints game, was pretty. You know, um, he opens his hips. Whenever it's a zone, he backpedals. He looks between the receiver and the uh, running back. He, his closing speed is pretty decent, and he hits pretty well. Um, you know, sometimes our cornerbacks don't hit them, don't hit. They don't take good angles, which sometimes that you know kind of messes us up, and it can lead to the other team resulting in a touchdown. So. Um, you know, some those just my lineup, and that's what I like. Um, a lot of people are gonna feel different ways, but you know, when normally when it's not a big rotational piece, sometimes when it comes to the cornerbacks, it's really just their starting three, and that's what they stick with. Um, now, if injuries happen, we know different people will be plugged in, but you know, to me. Everybody likes Jalen Mills. The teams like Jalen Mills. The 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 office likes Jalen Mills. But for me, I, I I cannot put him out there and just risk a lot of flags, risk uh, uh the, the double move um nightmares, which a lot of guys did get beat on. Avante got beat. I seen a lot of guys get beat by these double moves. So hopefully we can clean that up. But I think Craven LeBlanc is the guy. 
that, like I said, I'm going to keep praising him because he did very well when um the cornerbacks um our cornerbacks were uh, decimated with injuries. He did a great job of coming in. Uh, you know, I'm not saying he didn't get beat or he didn't, you know, but he made up for a lot of things. He he does a lot of things very well as far as a cornerback goes. So that's what I think, guys. I want to know what y'all think, man. Let me know what y'all think down in the comment section. Who should the Eagles start far as secondary-wise? Who do y'all got and what is y'all line up? Peace. Twine Eagles 215. And as always, fly, Eagles, fly.